Y'all better rise up for my new court show, Miss Pat Settles It. I'm the judge, and honey, I ain't taking nobody crap. Give me that power. Shut your mouth. <laughs> it's justice served up funny. This is the plaintiff, Jim Jones. He claims his time has been wasted by the defendant. He says the defendant spends too much time trying to match his clothes instead of matching his grind in the gym. This is the defendant, Fabulous. He says he doesn't even know why he's here and that it be your own people. Will he ever go to the gym or will he and Miss Pat go out to eat? It'd be your own friends. Miss Pat, can we get this set well, that's, how you go, that's how you bust yeah, it in? Yeah, well, I need like, to know I your need name to be here. first. I don't know what it's about. <laughs> But uh -oh. Wait a friends. minute now. Huh? We got to introduce. What's your name, sir? My name is Get Me Out of Here, Miss Pat. <laughs> well, that ain't no way in the hell your name is Get You Out of Here. Why am I here? <laughs> what is your name? Why up? Fab. Fab? Yes. Olis? Olis. All right, Jim Jones, cappuccino, because you look like a moke. <laughs> cappuccino is wild. <laughs> yeah. Tell me why you're here today. Um. I got. I have a. I have a, a grievance. Um, they say time is the most valuable thing that you could get, right? Yeah. And I'm trying to sue this man for all the hours of time in the this gym that he's wasting in mine. What? He, what? Why are you suing him for time? Because he's wasted my time in the gym. Gym. Day in and day out. So, so maybe a year ago, two years ago, we made a pact as a group of individuals to go to the gym. You know, I'm very serious about. Fitness, like that's my thing. Like I'm in the gym, trying to stay young. Trying. My friends, Fab, Maine, and Dave East, we all made a pack to go to the gym, which is cool. So I figured I'd lend my services, get everybody reacclimated to working out, and everything was going good. But in the beginning, everything was cool. Fab comes in, everybody, you know, I guess it's new. Everybody got on new clothes, and I'm not really noticing of it. And after a while, it starts to become a fashion show where it becomes too distracting for me. I mean, wow. when you come into the gym wearing Balenciagas wow. and, and, mm. and Louis, Louis Vuitton, it's like defeats the purpose of the workout. I'm really trying to get the workout, and he's coming fashionably late. Miss Pat, can you hit the Everything, gavel? everything is a fashion it? show. Can you like, be quiet? Right. Yeah, like I'm trying to state my case right. here, Jack. Let me listen to this man. Right. That's You know what that is? When you're from object. Brooklyn, you, when you're from no, Brooklyn, you can't you, you got, you got no you manners. You can't cut Jack and be quiet. Oh, That's yeah. what I'm saying. This is Brooklyn. It's, everybody from Brooklyn is rude like that. They got no manners. You ain't got to tell me. I don't like y'all, but keep going. I'm not from Brooklyn. You know, well, I'm you're from, from Harlem. Brooklyn, Where you from? I'm from Harlem. You familiar? Well, it's the same. No, it's not the same. Well, all Harlem of it's is New Harlem York, is quiet in Brooklyn. Okay. You heard? It's a lot of, it's, it's way, it's way, it's a, it's a lot of differences So there. get back to, so you suing Fabulous because he never got rid of his daddy gut? <laughs> no, I'm suing Fabulous because he thinks it's a game when he comes to the gym every day and thinks it's a fashion show. When he shows up fashionably late and he wastes my hour of time that I'm okay. lending him. Yeah, I like that uh, joke, Miss Pat, because it's really a joke while we're here. It's like, a joke. It doesn't make, it, it So does, tell me, tell me, tell me what you, what you got to say about him suing I, you I don't, for wasting time. I don't understand time. why I'm here, Miss Pat. You know what I'm saying? I'm here, you know what I mean? I was requested to come in, and when I come through the door, I see my friend. Who's worried Somebody, about your he really has a sick. He, he really has a sickness. Like, you, you ever had a sickness of, of fashion, like, a sickness that like he got to match his socks to his collar on his shirt. I go on a vacation with him one time. I watched him change five times in one day. Well, he looked like and he, he sweat a lot. And he had a whole pool outfit Pat, on. Let's, let's and just came get down like to the... what, what this case is about. I okay, what is hate, it about? Ms. Pat. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't believe it's hate. about the gym anymore. <laughs> what is it about? I don't believe it's about hate. It's a well, hate, hate thing. Well, hey, fabulous. He worried about your health. He worried about he my said health. He said he tired of you out here matching, like, Somebody granddaddy. You shouldn't match your socks to your collar. Listen, listen, Miss Pat. And he said you're wearing them big ass Bissalaka shoes. They so heavy. Balenciaga. Yeah, they you can't lift your feet. How you gonna walk on a treadmill, small frame the man like you with a little pop belly? How you gonna jog in them shoes? Your friend over here thinking you're gonna break your little ankles. Miss Pat, I'm starting to feel like you hating too now. <laughs> <laughs> like real. Like, what are, you, what, what are we talking about? You, you mispronouncing Balenciaga. You you know what I mean? I'm here because my sweatpants match my hoodie. That's not that's not a wrong, that's, that's there's nothing wrong with that. And I, that's why I say the basis of this case, case is hate, and you need to throw it out so I can go back to the mall and get some clothes, that's it. Uh, what do you um, want from him? You can't wear his clothes, look at him. He built like a baby. Oh, she's shooting at you, bro, what's up? 
You gonna let her get away with this? Well, what are you gonna do? Damn. I'm you... here because of you. <laughs> You want how much money do you want? What you want family to I mean, do? I'm actually, you want them to go I, to the I gym? I thought that you would have a, a, a resolution for me. I'm I'm telling Ms. you Pat, what, what I'm up against. Take consideration to be your own friends, Miss Pat. I'm sure you've had a friend that you Who thought was your friend. Who tried to get me to go to the gym? And they betray you. I didn't answer their phone call. You don't answer their phone call? If they try to get me to go to the gym. Oh, I I I mean. You, you, you don't that, have right? to. You're the judge. You don't. You, you shouldn't be judged. You are the judge. I don't like my thighs passing each other that fast. But I need you to to throw this case out. It's it's it's. it's Can I ask you, young ridiculous. man? Something I know is Harlem in Brooklyn, right? Mm -hmm. Is there any reason y'all in my courtroom with these glasses on? I mean, you in here looking like an undercover Nick Cannon. I'm a little worried. Oh, Why y'all got these glasses yo, on? She she shot wild shots at you. It's wild shots. That's because you're from Brooklyn. If you was from Harlem. You must, you look a lot more attractive with the glasses. I can see your eyes and I can see the hurt in your eyes that your friend just sued you for some nonsense. For time. I'm heartbroken. Time, time is not nonsense. Time, you can't get, you can't get time back. He doesn't take my time serious. You're not taking my time serious. It's, time is expensive, so I want to know where we're going with this exactly. What, what you want me to do? Now you want me to pay you? What's the going rate on time? I don't know. How much do time cost, Jim? A lot. Pat, why are you feeding into this? Why are you... I'm trying to understand this man who think he's God or somebody. We got to pay That's him for some That's what I'm time. saying. So wrap this up and let's get... Can I say something? Let's I get back God to the... Let's go to... Let's side. go eat, Miss Pat. Let's get up out of here. Let's Pat, go eat. God is on know, your side. I want to know who your barber is because he obviously wasted your time too because that's <laughs> crazy what you got going on, baby, bro. <laughs> You got to cool out. Bailiff, bailiff, uh -huh. there's no way you let them coming at you, you like that. There's no I way. You know what? You know what? Hold on. But hold, hold on, Miss Pat. Hold on, Miss Pat. Maybe. He got alopecia. Uh, uh, riddle me this. OK. You get that, Miss Pat? Yes, sir. I, you know riddle me. me. Let me Did hear you. Did you go to college? How you get this job? Exactly. Oh, I was a convicted felon. Now he's coming for you. You was a convicted felon, and you my judge. Uh-huh. So everybody's wasting my time now. Like Pat, it's getting, it's getting worse. Anybody and worse. Anybody suing Let's for time gotta be shit. smoking. <laughs> That's right. Anybody suing for time, they gotta be smoking. And I'm gonna sell it in favor of fabulous. Let's go. Because how, he had to how, win. How famous, because man. he had to win Let's because he walked that. to him with them church wonders on his jacket. That sells it. Yo, Miss oh, Pat. Yo. Thank you, Miss Pat. I'll see you in the gym. God bless you, Miss Pat. I'm gonna see you outside. Yeah, well, come on then. I take off this wig. I look like you. <laughs> I hope you ready. Hope I ain't you got on no bra. Three wig. people come to fight with me. <laughs> this is the plaintiff, Halo. He is suing the defendant for a later bedtime. He claims that he's not tired at 9.30 and needs to be able to stay up until 10 p.m. Will his dad think that it's too late? This is the defendant, 2 Chains. He says he doesn't want any smoke with mom by letting Halo stay up later. He says Halo owes him for stealing his cologne and scuffing his floors in the house. Is punishment on the horizon? Can you state your name for the court? Hi, my name is Halo. How are you doing today? I'm just fine. How are you doing? I'm doing good. I'm two chains. Okay. Halo and two chains. How you doing today, Halo? I'm doing well. How are you? Just fine. Can you tell me why you're here today? Staying up for a longer time, a longer bedtime. Oh, you want to stay up longer? Yep. So you decide to sue your daddy so you can stay up? Yep. And what do you want to stay up and do? Um, party. Party? Mm-hmm. What time do you want to stay up? At least about 10 o'clock. How old are you, Halo? I'm seven. you seven. And yeah. how old is your sister? 10. 10. So she get a, what time she go to bed? 10 o'clock. Well, she's a little older, so she can get an extra 30 minutes. She's 10 years old. 10 o'clock sounds about right. 10 to 10. 10 to 10. Yeah. I mean, technically, you seven. You should be in the bed at 6.30. Oh. I have reconstructed my whole living room, Judge, and this should be really a countersuit. My living room no longer looks like a living room. It looks like a, a basketball court. I had this huge goal in my living room that uh, is messing up my wood floors. He's shooting the ball so 
high from way back that is hitting the top of my ceiling. newly painted. I had my whole ceiling painted, but you see these little scuff marks. Scuffed you up. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. And uh, you know, I think he had some nerve to bring me here to stay up longer just to mess up my house. Let me ask you this, Halo. Do you think Daddy need to go to sleep earlier? Yeah. What time do you think? Oh, it's early as 7 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> now when you've been up the whole day. You've been up the whole day in the sun. That's a new day. What time do you think Daddy should go to bed? About 5 o'clock. <laughs> 5 o'clock a.m. So the reason just that I go to sleep at 7 is because I would like to see my kids off to school. If I go to sleep at 5, by the time they go to school, they have to be out the house by 7.30. So if I'm there around 7, I can give them all a hug, take a piece of turkey bacon out one day plate. Possible, you know? You know what I'm saying? Do stuff like that. And then I'll crash when they leave out the house. Halo, do you do any chores? Do you have any chores? I do indeed. You do indeed? So what do you have? Take out the trash. Mm-hmm. What else? That's it. That's all you got to do is take and out I the... And I do the dishes on a good day. Oh, oh good what's a day. good day to you, Halo? When it ain't none. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> we have to come to some kind of agreement with this bedtime stuff because y'all bring me on here, y'all get me caught in the middle, mama don't know what's going on, and then he's staying up, it's 9, 50, he ain't in the bed. I'm going to get in trouble. I can't let you do I can't. I mean, but if he give you 10, then you're gonna want 10.30, baby. No, 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 that's, that's when I get like nine. See, 10 o'clock, when I get 10, I get 10.30. Oh, oh really? So you got all the rules. So what? what's the whole purpose of, so you setting the rules, are you paying the bills? Basically. <laughs> he be paying the bills, he leave his light on all the time, he, 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 he used a lot of the the, the bills around electricity and, and everything, and he ought to use, he ought to pay them. Actually, I do pay them. You keep your lights on. I, I keep my lights yep. on? I like for it to be mm -hmm. dark, sir. I'm always going to your room, turn off a bathroom light, unhooking I'm it. always going to your room, turn off a bathroom light, or your room light. If my bathroom light is on, it's only because you're in my bathroom using my cologne. I don't, uh, I don't I have... I don't I have... I have my own cologne now. Oh, you do? So one day, I... Boy, I get him from school, give him a hug. Boy, smell good, you know? <laughs> Not he smell... Baby, you smell good. Boy, smell good, but you have been to school all day, play, ate. You, you smell... How you smell? You smell almost smell like a little grasshopper, you know? <laughs> He's smelling real good. He so he say, you know, Dad, I go in your room and I use about four or five of your colognes every day. You oh, five of them. That's what I said. Dang. Actually, I use about ten, but okay. Well, that's, who you it, smelling good it, for, it, baby? Five. So he just go. That, first of all, something that's something that's not right with that. I need to get them tested. You going in there? That's brand. Ten do. <laughs> the man, you don't even know how to. You don't even know what this smell is. You just know it's a fragrance. So, you know, people started giving him compliments. You know, that blew his head up. So uh -huh. now he got to have this cologne everywhere. Who, who you smelling good for? The lunch lady? Ladies. Ladies. Ladies? <laughs> I don't think there's no ladies in your class, baby. <laughs> you got girls. You mean the girls? <laughs> if I, if I turn the lights off more, turn your light bill down, then can I? They up to 10 o'clock. You're seven years old in the second second grade. You should be in the bed at least by 7, 7.30. All right, so I'm gonna have to settle this in favor of your daddy, and you gotta go to bed. I'm suing him $500. Oh, wow. For well, what? $500 for what? I owe you $500 for now. You done, damn, you done lost one. <laughs> what this here? Cause you want to sue him again? Mm -hmm. You haven't paid me in a minute for this dog stuff. This oh, dog for your chores. Oh. Ooh, oh, that's a good chores. one. Last oh. time you paid me was about two months ago for twenty dollars. So I owe you five hundred. Fifteen hundred. Fifteen hundred. What? 
I'm not finna give you no dog. You want sixty dollars? Yeah. Okay, two checks. No, I can do that. No, one hundred. Just one. Make a. Mm -hmm. I, 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 do I'm, you want six hundred, six thousand, yeah. or sixty? Just a hundred. Just a hundred. You want six hundred dollars? No, just a hundred. Just a hundred. You want a hundred? I can do that. Just one. All right. I can well, do that. He wants you to give him a hundred, but I'm that. gonna ask you to give him two hundred. I can do that. I can do that, Judge. Okay. I appreciate him for holding out in the house when I'm not there. I do. I appreciate it. Yeah. And now uh, he got a little back pay I owe, I owe him, so I, you know, fifteen a little too much, but I can I can work with two hundred. So two hundred. He was in the rears. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna sell her this uh, in favor of Halo. Right. So I'm gonna need you to give your daddy a hug, cause you got a good daddy. Look, y'all, I was just practicing with them fools, okay? But BET done made me a judge. Real verdicts, real families, and real situations. Y'all make sure y'all catch my new show, Miss Pat Settles It, every Wednesday night at 10 p.m.